changing the content of an existing quick part. Here we are in a blank Word document, and I want to change the content of an existing quick part. So I'm going to come to my Insert tab, and I'm going to go to my Text group and click Quick Parts, and I can see there's the Cakes quick part that we created earlier in the previous exercise. So I'm going to click this one time, and it'll automatically add all the content to my document. From here I want to select this first image and I want to adjust the size of it. So I'm going to go to my pictures format tab and over here in the size group I'm going to click the little dialog box launcher here in the bottom right corner. When I do I get my layout dialog box that opens. I can see here I'm on the um, I'm on the size tab and I want to come down to deselect this check mark next to lock aspect ratio. And then from here, I want to come up to my height area, and I can see absolutes already selected. So I'm going to click inside here, select this, and change it to 2. And then I'll press tab, and then I'm going to click OK. You'll notice that it maintained the width of the image but reduce the height of the image. Next I want to come and select my image of the mixer and here on my pictures format tab I'm going to come to my size group and I'm going to change the height. So I'm going to click inside here in the height and type 1.6 and then I'm going to press enter to accept it and you'll notice the image. It reduced the size of the image wrapping the text a little more appropriately around my image. Next, I want to change the wrapping of the text around my mixer image. So I'm going to click my layout options. And then I'm going to change it from tight to square. So I'm going to click square. There you go. Now when I deselect it, I can see the image is cleanly wrapping around this text. Next, I want to select everything. So I'm going to do a control A to select everything. Come back to my insert tab. Here in my text group, I'm going to click Quick Parts. And then I'm going to click Save Selection to Quick Part Gallery, keeping in mind the name of this quick part that I'm changing is Cakes. So I'm going to click this. That'll open up my Create New Building Blocks dialog box. And I'm going to type in that same name, Cakes. And then I'll click OK. Microsoft Word asks me, are you sure, is, do you want to redefine the building block entry? Yes. I'm going to click. And that's all there is to it. This is how you change the content of an existing quick part. Thanks for joining me. And remember, knowledge is power. Please share this with anyone who might benefit.